OK, so here we are beginning today in Texas. Businesses will likely be more full of people when you're out visiting them. Restaurants, retail stores and other businesses will be allowed to open at 75% capacity. That is a jump from 50% capacity at what we were before and for the last few months. So Hannah Davis live this morning in Plano and Hannah businesses have been waiting for this day. Good morning, Carrie. Yeah, we're out here at Plano West or Legacy West rather, and there's tons of businesses and restaurants that will be changing the way they do things because today is when the new order goes into effect. But a lot of the business owners we talk to say it really depends on the size of the business that it will depend on how much of an impact this new order is going to have. So let's take a look at the order and now the impact. Governor Abbott's new order goes into effect this morning, allowing restaurants, retail stores, gyms and museums to move from 50% capacity to 75%. We talked to business owners over the weekend about what this means to them. The majority say it will help for their bottom line, but the larger restaurants and stores say it will have more impact on them because they have space to add those additional tables. Smaller places, however, they may only have to sit at 50% because social distancing simply isn't allowed or possible rather inside those small areas. Now we did talk to some local business owners who say they're really uh, encouraged by the state officials trying to find ways to improve the situation, but they say the gov federal government needs to step up again. One of the owners we talked to said they got that PPP from the federal government, but since then there really has not been any leadership or assistance from the federal level. It just seems to me that we've well, the nation's just kind of moved on and and, uh, you know, they're going to be nominating a new Supreme Court justice before they even discuss the second aid package. And uh, it just seems like the, the workers on the ground are just uh, not a priority right now. You know, small businesses just trying to figure it out. And I've talked to so many entrepreneurs during this entire pandemic, and they really are just so solution oriented, trying to find those solutions in this really difficult time. We do want to point out one business or industry that was exempt from this or not included was the bar industry. They're not allowed to reopen bars and nightclubs, although the state has made it easier for bars to reclassify themselves as restaurants so they can reopen for some time. Of course, this can all change from day to day, so we will continue to cover it. Kara, back to you. Yeah, big reminder, a lot of people's lives have not gone back to normal. Very frustrating for those business owners. Thank you, Hannah.